Well, we'll tell you what we learned today what? was this new word, compromise. Yeah. So I'll explain what compromise, what happened about compromise. Why don't you explain what you thought compromise was before I taught you what compromise actually was? Okay, compromise, I thought, the way you've talked about it is I have to do everything you say. No, no, you quite clearly showed that you thought that compromise meant you do whatever you want to do and I don't complain about it and that in your world was compromise. Right. First of all, that's so Bob. I So I taught, re-taught you what compromise really was, right. which is that you, you figure out what you want yeah. and then you figure out what I want and then you find a way to meet in the middle so that we can both get what we want in mm. in the most optimal way right. possible. Okay, so, so I basically, I drive Chloe Everywhere. No, nowhere. I drive you everywhere because you always say that you've got work to do <laughs> and you want to. Oh, I'm doing this new DJ mix and I want to put it up on Spotify. I don't sound like a whiny bitch. I have, when loads, I'm of, I have loads of emails to do. It's like, true. I haven't emailed anybody back. And yeah. can you drive yeah. every so, time? So, and, then, and then you lie and pretend no. every single time your favourite thing to do is right. to lie and say, I drive no. everywhere. No. But that's so not I, true. So, okay, fine. So that's Chloe's version. My version is I drive everywhere. Yeah, my version is the truth. I drive everywhere 99% the time i've got the mileage to back it up and i will provide with this video some data just to show you um but essentially when i get in the car i've got emails to do i put my headphones on because chloe likes to listen to really educational health and fitness yeah really stuff. droney shit which right? is you know ironic because you you know claim that you're interested in health and fitness yet <laughs> i never see you paying any interest in yeah. any of this I do, stuff i do i do i do I, I pay interest but not when i'm trying to work i can't have some american going oh my god my calories i forgot my calories how much calories in the egg is butter a carb i can't have that shit that in is my absolutely 100 percent right. nothing so, like yeah, what yeah, i yeah. listen right. to anyway so i'm trying to get this fucking story out so you don't know Shut up, right? So um, as we, as I listen to music, right? So Chloe and I have got a deal because when she gets in the car, uh, and lads, you, you might not know this, you know, if your missus do the same thing, they fuck around with the air conditioning, they stab their sticky fingers on the buttons, You're they close all, the, they close all the vents, <laughs> they like fiddle with heated seats, the car turns into a sauna, uh, you know, they're stabbing at buttons. Just so you know, like the fact that you have heated seats is not like a normal oh, thing. Right, fine whatever right so we've got all these bits and bits of beasts so Chloe's stabbing at things closing vents it's like 40 degrees in here we've got American droning on so I put my earphones on try and work we've got a deal that we've come through through many arguments where Chloe taps me on the shoulder I lift one earphone and I engage with her and it's normally but he about... doesn't engage he goes <laughs> and like begrudgingly like moves his headphone half a oh, millimetre back yeah, right. This is bullshit. So that isn't compromise. That's you saying, drive me so I can work. I'm going to put my headphones on and be super antisocial. Right. And every time you try and talk to me, I'm going to right. make a little fuss about it. Crap. It's crap. 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 It's just crap. Um, so basically, I then, so I, I, Chloe's tapped me so, sort of six times today. So lift my earphone up. Yeah. You know, hear what she's got to say. Remember it. Engage with her. Make eye contact with her. Like nod. Yeah. Fine. Remember everything. However, I was in the middle of a key email, which I still haven't finished. What's um, the email? One. What's the it's email? It's to a guy who's offering me to come DJ at some different clubs in London. Because uh, I don't know if you know that I do a lot of DJing now. So there's a lot of playing now. Um, and uh, so anyway, I, Chloe was, was listening to something and um, we were stopping at a petrol station and she wanted to show me something, but I was trying to carry on finishing this email. So she tapped me and I lifted it up and it was some woman in her underwear, a performance model. And I just went, oh God, stop and carried on. And then we had to stop the car, turn all the engines off. Chloe turned to me and taught me what compromise was. And apparently <laughs> I wasn't compromising enough no. because I wasn't fully engaging. This is utter bullshit. No, no, yeah. no. Let me be very clear. If you ask somebody to do you a favor, yeah. i.e. I've got loads of work to do, yeah. please can you drive me like you always do yeah. to my physio appointment yeah. in London yeah. tonight. Yeah. And your partner is kind enough to say, okay, yeah. I'll drive you. And then you're rude enough to put headphones on for the whole journey. So not only are they driving you while you work, but you literally are like shutting off all communication. Yeah. The compromise in this situation is I will do you a favor and I will drive you so you can do your work to your physio yeah. appointment in London. But when something happens that I want to talk to you about, which will probably be on average once every 10 or 20 minutes, just take your headphone off and respond. Yeah. Well. 
lads, I know Say there's a... la compromise. Also, I think you need to tell people the joke that I made up today. Yeah, lads, there's going to be a lot of you out there who are going to have a similar situation. Please comment, please share this. Um, because it's really interesting to hear all the other people that are going through the struggle. And just another thing, you sort of compromise, but when you do a favour, you have to do it with good grace and you can't hang it over someone. No, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Don't be a spoiled little brat, right? You can do a favour with good grace and not hang it over someone, and then that some, yeah, and then that have someone, and then that someone can take the piss out of the favour that you're doing for them like put their headphones on and ignore you for three hours while you drive them to their physio appointment in London fully take the piss in which case in that mitigating circumstance the person doing you the favour is entitled to say actually can you not ignore me for three hours just because I'm doing you a favour like I'd quite like to still be acknowledged right okay well on that note thanks so much for tuning in tell again. them my joke oh uh, what is your joke <laughs> tell it Tell it, tell it, and then everything will everything will fall into place as to why our relationship like it is. Go on, tell, tell them, tell them that. What do you call a cannibal poo? Cat. Thanks for tuning in.